we really want to work in a unifying way to get the job done here. As the president fiddles, people are dying. Are you saying that, that his downplaying ultimately cost American lives? Yes, I am. I'm saying that because when he made, uh, the other day when he was signing the bill, he said, just think, 20 days ago, everything was great. No, everything wasn't great. We had nearly 500 cases and 17 deaths already. And in that 20 days, because we weren't prepared, we now have 2,000 deaths and 100,000 cases. That's the most shameful, disgusting statement by any politician in modern history. This is the same Speaker of the House who held up the bill in the Senate for days because she wanted same-day voting. She wanted carbon neutrality for the airlines. She wanted $75 million for the endowment for the humanities and $25 million for the Kennedy Center. Both sides were getting ideas included in a plan. And then yesterday, the Speaker of the House showed up with an agenda. And all of a sudden, it got taken over at the leadership level. And so now, instead of talking about helping workers, we're talking about the Green New Deal. What concerns me is when I listen to Nancy Pelosi talk about a fourth package now, it's because she did not get yeah. in the things that she really wanted, to change the election law, a Green New Deal, expand, make us pay for Planned Parenthood, and expand what, what you're seeing for sanctuary cities. I want to thank all Americans for pulling together, for coming together, for doing what they have to do. It's been incredible. It's been inspirational. I want to thank you for the incredible job you're all doing. There's spirit in our country like never before. We are really, we've pulled together as a unit. We pulled together as a country. We will prevail together. We love the USA. What I'm trying to do is work well with the federal government. We have got thousands and tens of thousands of masks and gloves, and we really appreciate from the federal stockpile. Mm -hmm. We we're having soldiers, the 627th from Colorado, arrived yesterday to build a hospital for us uh, in CenturyLink Field. So there's some good things happening from the federal government, and we have a lot of gratitude mm -hmm. for everybody involved in that. I said to the president, uh, I put my hand out in partnership. Uh, we've had political differences in the past. Forget about that. And let's work together. The federal government has done a great job of communicating with us. We've had five calls with all of the governors, with the president and, and or vice president, and many of the top leaders. We've we had a request uh, for about 10 different things, most of which they've tried to address. And don't forget, I was there for the State of the Union address and did greet the president at that time.